Select and make your first pick. Skin it on down. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Skin it on down. Choose and pick the best one. Skin it on down. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Skin it on down. If you like the video you're watching today, please like and subscribe to the channel. Also, if you want to donate to me, which helps me a lot because it's tough times out here with COVID going on, check the link in the description. But with that being said, welcome back to another exciting episode of the Rivals of Ether Workshop Spotlight. I'm your host, The Jank, and today's character is literally the suitcase. And this made by Wydrick, shout outs to him. I, I, I would never have thought, I mean, every time I see a crazy character like this, I'm just like, and these are usually the busted ones, the ones you don't see coming, so. But let's get right into the colors. Um, red, blue, brown, okay, so he's simple. Where's my Game Boy color I usually look for? Purple. I'm assuming this is infamous, I guess, the black one. 10, I don't get what that means. If y'all know what that means, um, please let me know in the comment section. He, okay, there's my Game Boy color. And then I'm guessing that's supposed to be the cold and cold gold. Oh, he's a lot of colors. Start with. Start with. Golden. Yo, what is. These obviously represent something. We'll check those out too. But let's pick the original color first, which is the red one. And this shadow actually goes to Squiddy505 for the stage I'm about to pick, um, which is called the Ice, Ice Field, which I gotta find real quick. So give me a second, guys. Okay, Aurora Ice Field. And for those who don't know, the Aurora Ice Field is actually a shout out to Sonic the Fighters. So that's kind of cool. So that's kind of cool too. So, and the person who made this stage, actually a shout out to him. I want to make sure I give everyone this due. I know I forget all the time, guys, but I try. Lucky Rick. So, with that being said, let's get into the moveset. Yo, his movement though. Yo, this stage song is... Nice, thank you, Squiddy. Anyway, jab. That's simple. Four tilt. Oh, so this character looks like he's on a level system. Okay, that's kind of interesting. Up tilt. Wait, so if you get this, so if you tap up tilt, he'll do this. But if you hold it. It'll snap back into place and gets a, a, um extra second hit. Cool, so I can throw people off. Okay, forward smash. Yo, that forward smash though. Yo, it's like a it's like a suitcase German suplex. Up smash. Why did I want to change the color? I wonder if that has to do with the uh, the whole leveling up system. Down smash. Nair. Does it hit multi hit? Nope. Fair. Back here. Ooh! I love that, Dare. All these multi hit moves. Y'all know I love my multi hit. Okay. Special attack? Neutral special? Is that part of his leveling thing? You know what those chunks look like, guys? It looks like the chunks um, from when you play Abyss mode, the, the leveling up system for that. I wonder if this is the, how you got the idea. Anyway, forward special. Which is a freaking taxi car. Oh, it seems like you can spin it back like almost like um Bowser Jr. That's kind of cool. Okay, down. Up special. Oh, so you have to tap this one out. Okay, so it's a little helicopter. I wonder if he gets an extra hit, like, from the blade himself. I will know, never know. Down special? Whoa, what's this? Guarded faucet. Neutral special leaks. So if you hit the attack button, you can get this special. But if you hit neutral special... I mean, neutral special, then it avoids it. So let's hit it. We accept it. So now we accept it. Oh, that's the leaking part now. So now it hits multiple hits afterwards. That's kind of cool. Game breaking glitch. Wave dash up. Wait, I missed it. 
Oh, so these leveling, the leveling up is random. So, what is it? Milestone system. So, it basically makes all his moves have different properties as he fights. That's kind of cool. So, let's try this max taunt thing. Taunt and parry. Okay, so this is all the max level thing. So, let's see what happens. How many levels he's allowed to go during the max. So, did he just keep going? Prototype MK7. Wait a minute. So, there's like an infinite. So, this is just a, a crazy infinite amount of leveling stuff. Burger Barrage? Burger Breakfast? Oh, the neutral special now got burgers added to it. Four special. So by the time you go up in levels, so this is literally like an RPG system, like leveling system with the character. I like this. I mean, I don't think I'll be able to go through all the leveling mechanics, but. Well, how do you activate the? Question, how do you activate the MK? I don't know how to do it, but this is an interesting character. So I guess there's no more left to get. Cause it seems like all I have left is like healing stuff. So I think I bought everything in the store, just about. So everything gets leveled up, basically, your health and everything. And it, and, it, and it seems like the leveling system is like infinite. Let me stop this. Oh, that's the air horn. So that's what that buffs. Okay, so this is the full power ring. So it seems like, based on all the buffs you get, you get height and jump. You get more HP. Your All your special attacks gain extra abilities, like the hamburgers. Forward special go looks like it goes even faster. Forward tilt does like this explosion apparently. Which I don't know how that works exactly. But it seems like it's randomized. Like when it happens or whatever. So I guess let's get into some moves. Um, if you like what you're watching today though. Um, please like and subscribe as we get into the versus mode. So this character is kind of interesting. So you fight. You level up. You level up. You gain new moves and abilities. So let's so and I guess these represents the moves you can start out with. So let's start out with this one though. Cause I'm curious. I wanna try to start with well actually no, here's what I wanna do. I'm gonna do the first couple matches by with the, the first match regular, and then I'll do the next two matches with those added bonuses. Sounds fair? Let's do that. At least you can jump out of the, um, the forward special, though. That's a... Oh, it doesn't spike! So, Dare doesn't really spike! Dare's for sp for comboing! Oh, I, I fat fell. That was my fault, guys. Sunny Collar. Ooh, go ahead! Don't forget, guys, you can void whatever you don't want. So that's the cool thing about it. Upward boost. I def well, I lost my upward boost. 
There you go. So it stays there until you officially agree to not want it. Okay, so even if you get hit out of it, the move you initially had still stays on the list. So that's something we did like. Up tilt? No. No one up tilt. Oh, neutral special lens. So now neutral special jumps multiple times now. That's kind of cool. So before, the moment it hits the ground, remember, it just got destroyed. Not falling for that yet. I am killing myself by accident, guys. My bad. I'm just curious if the, um... Bear up. So I guess I go higher now with my um my ultimate. Awesome. Yo, I forgot the second hit when you hold it. So there's the suitcase for that one. So now we're gonna do whatever this one is. The little thing that looks like a two pace. Oh, it, it counts to wait. So now we learned something. Every time I avoid it, call, it counts towards your money too. Look like because now I don't have. Seem like I have upgrades for it. So oh, so you so you might as well just grab everything then. Every time you avoid it, then you might as well just grab everything then. So it costs for you to, to not keep something you don't want then. Okay. I'm not out that bad. No, yet. No, no, no. The suitcase German. Oh, now we know. I finally figured out. Well, I figured when I figured out. So now we know the up, the up special actually hits some multiple hits with the helicopter. That makes sense. Almost like how King K. Rule hits with his up special. It's almost similar to that. We're not dead yet. We're living. I love how it said all special strong and it said CEO. Like like the tournament or whatever. There's a little little, little nuanced references there. It literally says CEO. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, up tilt lingers more now. That's kind of sick. That will kill me, but I'm gonna kill him with this Ford. German. 
You're not gonna let me do it? You gotta let me do it. You gotta let me do it! Oh, if I keep trying to do this, he's gonna kill me. Almost back here him. Oh man, I might actually die, guys. Or not. There we go! So that's cool that the colors can make you stand out and do different things. That's actually kind of cool. And this one gives me this screech thing or whatever. So let's see what that does. And I guess last I'll end it on golden. That's what makes it convert it to that. Now it makes sense. Now we know what converts. So the the yelling makes it so you get a spike for your um dare now. That's actually kind of cool. So you can start with a spike for your dare. And I, I do like that. You know I love my spikes. So. You know, be crazy if the gold one. Has um all the moves a lot. Oh, and when you die, you lose a level too. So, so it's important to use all your stuff, guys. Yo, okay. The white one seems like my favorite one now. character Was sick okay we'll do one final match guys and this time with the golden suitcase and see if i get something extra because of it like i'm really curious like if there's like a golden like if there's like something busted that comes with it yo that's cool So this is basically just vast in my greatness, vast in my luggage. Fast stock there, guys. You deserve a level up.
You going, it's gonna happen sooner or later. That German's gonna happen. Ooh! Mr. Embers. I did not mean to put that in the void. I need that I threw away the one thing I needed I was waiting for that move that was the spike that I did early in the last match guys that's why I, I just screwed up and lost I just want to continue watch I know I could kill them but with my thoughts I never thought I will have so much fun with the suitcase. That's what caught me off guard. I love all the different items. Um, if you want to know what all the items is, if you go to the page, there's a whole Discord server explaining like all the characters. This character was way more technical than I thought. Very misleading character. They call him the roguelike um, rival, and I see why, because the way he builds up every round. So he's a roguelike lo rogue -like character in a fighting game, and he literally packs a punch, no pun intended. But with that being said, I recommend you download the character. This character is a lot of fun, very balanced, and I'll catch you soon, everyone, and peace.